Today we're going to cover the install of the Barn Door Easy Latch System. Now's a great time to pause the video and check your package contents to ensure that you have all the pieces required. Make sure you have your instructions handy while watching this video. There are several tools required that are not provided. Pause the video and make sure that you have everything you need before we continue. Step one, measure down 47 and a half inches and make a small line on the edge of the door where the handle will be installed. Step two, position the bottom edge of one T bracket on the line centered on the edge of the door and mark a hole location in the center of each slot. Position the top edge of the door handle assembly at the line made in step one, ensuring the small lip is located on the edge of the door and mark the four hole locations with an awl. Position the top edge of one T bracket 5 eighths from the top of the door edge centered on the door side and mark a hole location in the center of each slot. Step three, using a 1 8 drill bit, drill all the marked hole locations 3 quarter of an inch deep, including the front door assembly holes. Do not drill deeper than 3 quarters of an inch and do not drill through the door. Step four, affix both T brackets, one upper and two lower using one inch screws provided. Note, ensure the brackets are centered on the door. Step five, insert the square rod down through the lower T bracket on a slight angle. Ensure the holes at the bottom of the square rod are facing the door side edge. Step six, insert the engagement pin block assembly into the bottom end of the rod with the pin facing the side of the door the handle will be affixed to as shown in step eight. Note, angle the rod slightly so you can access the screw holes and affix with the screws provided. Step seven, raise the rod up through the upper T bracket. Step eight, position the handle assembly on the door ensuring the handle is in the lowered position as shown and the engagement pin is located in the slot of the handle. Affix the handle assembly to the pre-drilled holes in the door using the screws provided. Step nine, remove the existing door stops from each end of the track. Replace with the end stops provided. Position end stop so the door is in the desired open and close position and tighten the set screws with an Allen key. Note, the new end stop should work on most standard 78 and three quarters and 96 inch tracks. Step 10. Have a second person stay on the handle side of the door, the front, while you move the door to the closed position. Hold the catch block onto the bottom of the track. Note, place outside of the new end stop with the catch block set screws facing toward the back. Have the other person push the handle in and rotate it downward to raise the rod into the catch block. Tighten the set screws. Step 11, snap the cover onto the handle assembly ensuring the emergency key slots face the side of the rod. Step 12, test the emergency key so that you're familiar with how it operates. Store the key at the back of the track between the track and the catch block as shown. Guess what? You did it. Enjoy your new Renan Easy Latch. For more Renin products, visit us online at renin.com or find us on Instagram at Renincorp.